We are back with World Cup Poeg vs Gypsy King. We have uh, BTB and Count in the call. And yet, yeah, this team that Poeg has, it kind of looks like something I love League would use. It's not Poke TG Games team. Uh, BTB was just asking me. Because yeah, Pokedex Gamers team has a... Um, this is basically two cards going at it, so this is going to be a fun game to yeah, catch. Yeah, Spain vs Oceania. <laughs> Damn, he it's brought Alamon Mola. I assume this is going to be... Is it, is it uh, Scarf? Teeny? Or is it like AVV Teeny to like check Volk? <laughs> I think the latter. I think this would be uh, either Ashgren or... I could definitely see it be Spikes anyway. Poek is using a Gastrodon and Weavile, which is not that common, and uh, Gypsy King is using... This is a free Toxic. Yeah. yeah. And as long as he doesn't have Grass not on Gren. <laughs> he spikes Ash Greninja, which makes me think that he's Scarf Victini then. Yeah, exactly. I agree. Or Assault Fest Victini, but probably it. Scarf. I've seen Gypsy use a Sub Zygarde and OUPL, but on this team I think he's Bandit. Hmm. You can even Toxic again. Like <laughs> yeah, what is he even going out uh, into here? Like, because Gren no is probably like Hmm. Like, why is there such less love for this game? Oh, because it's because it's basically this... two gods playing. Yeah, it's like it's very early for it's Americans. <laughs> super early in the morning. Yet it's why no one is online. Yeah. Exactly. That's why I'm not recording the chat at the moment because there's nothing going on. Does he toxic? Yes. Oh, nice. I mean, probably that's why you don't go so that was, yeah. he could have, yeah. I don't know why he went to Mamola. What is it gonna do? Wish up? Toxic this? Like, he's probably gonna he want to toxic. He's probably expecting a, a play like. Hmm. I mean. He, he yeah, to? he probably expected Mew there. Uh, a double to Mew for for an immediate defog. Because Greninja is like choice locked into Spike, so. Yeah, mm -hmm. he, so I think that's why he went Alumola, but uh, I probably would not have risked it because Alumola is pretty crucial, and once it gets toxic, the toxic it basically becomes useless. Yeah, so. yeah I assume this is. He also um, has to keep this Gastrodon alive because Gastrodon is great for his gypsy. I assume this is like, actually, um, yeah. a life up turn. Because he has Spadef Gastrodon <laughs> plus yeah. Tapu Bulu to check. Yeah, Ash I King. agree. I agree. Or, or it could be Z Fly. Uh, no, it's probably Z Bulu. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Did we will all I see ever in Sun and Moon is like Fuck banded, you. but I think Gypsy Rock just strand? wants to get up a toxic on it or something. Pretty much. Uh, I mean I this gets a free wish. sub if he has subs, so Yeah, I would sub as well. On the yeah. wish. Because Alan Mula, I don't think it can even break the sub because it's just piss we Uh I think it can though. It still steps uh, steps are perfect. That's like thirty. You don't know how weak it is. Like Toxapex. Toxapex also breaks it. You don't know how weak it is. It's like a it's like a roll in Poek's favor to not break it, I guess. Skull does 22 to 25. Yeah. 25.7. Exactly. Knockoff? Knockoff definitely breaks it. I don't know if he has it. No, no. Knockoff doesn't break it. Because... Uh, no, Knockoff doesn't break it. His attack is way higher, though. Defense investment plus 252 HP, so yeah. Knockoff definitely yeah, doesn't break it. Did you calc it? I'll calc it, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't break. Its attack is 35 points higher. <laughs> yeah, but it's not super effective. Yeah, and Knockoff does 12 to 14, yeah. <laughs> Jesus, yeah, exactly. there's nothing. nothing. So this is looking yeah, really good for Poik. Yeah. It's had to get rocks. rocks. Yeah, it had to be rocks. Hmm. Hmm. I'm just wondering, because if Gypsy gets up more spikes, Poik might want to defog, so I'm not sure if I would have gone yeah, for exactly. rocks. Yeah, exactly. I, I thought he was going to click Toxic there, to be totally honest. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think subbing also didn't. Rox is still, still fine. Rox is like still fine for bar. pressure with Victini. Yeah, yeah. True. Very true. So if he, you think he's gonna go for like Iron Tail or Toxic here on the top of Bulu? I don't think so. I think the first time you just scout. The thing is, Zygarde is pretty obvious, and Zygarde is like a huge threat to Poex team because yeah, his only check, his only check is Bulu. in Bulu. And yeah, but Bulu I don't know like if he would land uh, Bulu in Zygarde. here if he would. How much does the uh, defensive Mew take? Defensive Mew can avoid a 2 hit KO if it's like yeah. super defensive, but... It, mm -hmm. it, it avoids a 2 hit KO after rocks, right? So... Mm -hmm. um, I it does like 43, to 43 or 45 or something like that, but it basically... And it can go to Mew, because sure. if he wants a Toxic, then the Zagat gets Toxic as well. <laughs> mm -hmm. If he's uh, 72 oh. defense, it does 42 to 50. But, 
but I'm but I'm but I'm pretty sure this is not Are Banzai you? Guard. <laughs> is it Banzai Guard? Okay, yeah, it's Banzai Guard. Okay. It's Bandit. Yeah. Oh, it's Thousand Waves. Oh my oh, goodness. Oh shit. So this is probably the um. Trap. He's gonna trap the Mew yeah, here. he's probably he's substitute and toxic. and toxic. Yeah, but the, then his Zyga gets fucked. But up if he's too. toxic, then he gets toxic as well. Exactly. Like, yeah. Unless it's rest talk, which it could be. Yeah. Yes. Even if weak. he subs, even if he subs, synchronize goes through the sub. This is something I learned in one of my games. Really? I did not know that actually. <laughs> yeah, it's something I learned in my final uh, Circle Jerk Tour game. Oh yeah, I know that. How that works. So. I mean, if he's not here. rest, this is like not good for Gypsy. Yeah, exactly. He still doesn't gain anything. I he tried to trap the uh, Bulo and an Iron Tated or something. <laughs> I know that Sidurz likes the set, and Sidurz uses um, Sub Protect Toxic Thousand Wave. To oh, it's still banded, duh. To trap Tangrowth. <laughs> oh, wait, there was it's really, still banded. There's really banded, they did nothing. So it's just That's so that. It's just so people can so, double so switch, so I assume. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. That, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's it's really banded, yeah. So I'm actually bad for not realizing. So yeah, I was thinking the same. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, so it's like he traps the blue and he goes out into the um, Victini. Now, what is it? What does it exactly trap? I want to know that. Hmm. I'm like, not really sure what Tangrowth? this is for. Because Tangrowth is a soft ball. Come on. If he traps the Tangrowth, he can't go into the Victini because of knockoff. So I'm not mm -hmm. sure what the Thousand Waves does. Uh, unless he's like probably Z move Victini and takes nothing from knockoff from or something yeah, he, like but that. But he should be Scar sure. Victini because he showed that he's Ash Greninja. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I, I agree. Think, I think be. he's Z move uh, Lando Magirna. Mm -hmm. uh, would like, it be A Fimic? Yeah, it has to be A Fimic Yerna, right? Uh, I think unless it's, it's um, Sky Strike you know Lando. Kind of what? Because Ooh. it no longer checks the V Vile. He Goku gets a, is hard. He gets a free Gastron here, pretty much. He's gonna Dark Pulse, right? Like I mean, Gastron <laughs> eats it up. As long as it doesn't yeah. get flint. After the spike, he doesn't like it, though. Yeah, it still eats. Okay, well, one flinch and uh, that's an Ashgren. <laughs> no, I'll show you the Kalk. Um, Spadev. It does like 30-something, right? There yeah, it goes. I think they run like 170 Yeah, he, does he have another hero spike yeah. here? Yeah. He goes for Dark Pulse, yeah, that's fine. He, he has, has to recover. The thing is, so if he, he, he gets one flinch now... Well, that yeah, actually, did, he, that actually he, did more he, than I thought. Really I thought it only does like 32. Nah, it does like 30, 30 high. Yeah, um, but um, he yeah, still is toxic, so even if he does flinch now, he's gonna be like at 20%. Yeah, he can still go wee well if he gets flinched here. Or maybe he's gonna... Mm -hmm. Actually, I don't think he's gonna go hard yeah, well. And, and he takes 18% from the ne uh, next toxic, so mm -hmm. it's already like... He wants this to be healthy, so yeah, he, I think he, he's he gonna stay go in. Yeah. yeah, so now he's gonna wish... And he's gonna wish pass to. He, yeah, he's I gonna try to get off a wish pass to. Polix should win. Yeah. But I mean, that's so obvious that he might not do it. <laughs> oh, Gypsy, Actually, Gypsy doesn't have hazard control, so I guess it's understandable that he went for rocks. Mm hmm. The one play which Polix should not do is risk the Scarred Burn on the um, top of Boulder here. No, yeah. I agree. Like. No, I agree. But like, like Gypsy could just click Scald. Can he just go Heatran uh, on this? A misplay on the Bulu, and if he gets the burn, it's like pretty much game. Okay, it's not pretty much game, but it's uh, it's basically a superior position for Gypsy King. Does Sequin Ninja die to uh, Heatran? I don't think so. Can do like 30 something. Uh, you mean. When Ninja can Heatran? switch into Heatran once, I assume. But it's no, no, uh, yeah, but then it it's pretty much power, dead right? then. Because Earth power doesn't kill, right? No, it right? can't switch into an Earth power. I think if Gypsy goes around, if Boy goes around in this Heatran, he's definitely clicking Earth power. Like, yeah, no, I agree with that, but does it kill? I don't think so. At like 50% Greninja? I mean, even if it doesn't kill, he dies to poison if he dark poses the incoming gas rune then. Oh, I mean, he still gets to wish up him, right? Earth power toxic kills. Oh, you're talking about oh. if he wishes here, okay. Yeah, I didn't think the next turn through. Yeah, if he wishes here, then goes to Greninja on the Heatran switching. Yeah, I mean, yeah, can, like, he does, can he yeah, substitute yeah, if he has Earth power does like 78, uh, if I recall correctly, because I played Gypsy King in uh, in finals of Cash Tour ones and... Mm -hmm. uh, the uh, and he went for the Earth power on the Greninja and it did like 78 to my Greninja, so... It does, yeah. um, it does specs though. It's it does 47 to 50. No, 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 no. There, there, was, yeah, there was just... Exactly. It was just max special attack. Yeah, max special Jesus attack does Christ. obviously more, but he showed rocks, so I assume he's some bulky trend. Yeah, max exactly, HP, exactly max speed, bulkier. Maybe? 
Like I was talking about sub turn earlier, but since he showed rocks, I don't think he's sub anymore. Hard Bulu. I don't I like, like that, that play. Oh yeah, exactly. That's why you go heat trend. Ah. Uh. I mean, it, it's mm -hmm. still okay. Yeah. yeah. It's okay because it can't get burned anymore. Think but he's still... gonna go hard Bulu, predicting SD, and then Sky Strike this man away. <laughs> he is in Bulu. <laughs> Like, oh, I meant Landris, like hard Landris. Did I say blue? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Like, if you would be seal here and consider ri risk and reward. No, don't. Uh, don't mention seal in this. He doesn't deserve. <laughs> he doesn't deserve this. <laughs> poor soul. <laughs> that poor uh, soul. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, this is fine. This this is fine for Poyek, I guess. It's not too bad. Uh, I would just warn each year. Don't think you lose you too much. What? I would just horn leech here. Mm -hmm. I mean, if he's yeah. sky strike, would... is a fine. if he has um, the Z wood hammer, he could probably go for that. SD here? I mean, that's why I would go hard landers, breaking the SD to sky strike. Yeah, exactly, because if he goes landers, then you don't gain yeah, anything. If he has bloom doom, you can click that here and nuke something. He can, he can, definitely. Like, McJuna yeah, yeah, right. and landers don't really want to switch into bloom doom. If he has. Mm -hmm. Z bloom doom is like so dangerous. Yeah. Z bloom doom, it... that's a bit Yeah, it can break through resists. <laughs> like, it's crazy. Yeah. I still would just click Hornet here, even if I had the Z move, because I would want to scout what he wants to do here. What does he switch in? Does he switch in Lando? Is it Helmet? Does he go to Bagirna? What set is that? Like, I just want to see, get yeah, information. I still think it's Z move Lando and AV Bagirna, yeah. Yeah, I agree, I think so as well. But like, you can scout, so, you can see. I assume he has 1000 arrows and 1000 waves, I could see we still want I'm assuming, yes. Yeah, yeah. He, he probably doesn't have Toxic. So E speed and then outrage or dragon. Mm -hmm. Outrage or tail. Hard landers. Intimidate. Z move. Is it Bloom Doom? Yup. Jesus. Exactly. Fuck. That's why I didn't <laughs> go for SD because then. Um, the is that defensive land now? I'm assuming. 72. You know it was minus one. That's a Bloom Doom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's defensive. It has to be at least max HP or some investment. Yeah, exactly. I figured. It's a fucking Bulu. You don't mess around. Yo, now that this lander is, uh, if this lander is actually dies, this Bulu is a huge problem. Holy fuck. Yeah, that's why I didn't, wouldn't have let it get the to toxic on that. Yeah. But that's why the Alamola was so, uh, it's so scary to use because Bulu can come in on it, especially now that it's toxic and can't get burned anymore. Like, you just keep hornleeting and the opponent yeah, hates Bloom, it. Bloom does 70 to yeah, 80. And Bulu has, like, no, like, almost no defensive checks. Like, you can argue that Skarm is a defensive check and stuff, but mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to be honest, he just sets up SC on it and breaks the sturdy with Horn Leech and just knocks it out with a super power. Yep. Like that. So, Bloom basically, super, Taku yeah. has no defensive checks. This defensive Lando. Bloom Bloom does a 70 to 83. Okay, Jesus. <laughs> That's crazy. And, so, you got like, a low even, roll there. Like, kind of low. The, probably the only defensive uh, check to Tapu Bulu would be. Rocky Helmet tank with Sludge Bomb. Woo! See, it's 9 in the morning for the American friends. That's when like, no one yeah. is online. Is Powak, uh, where's Powak from? Uh, Spain. And okay, Gypsy yeah, is from Oceania, <laughs> yeah, so yeah, that's what I'm playing now. So, uh, he's probably gonna go Gastrodon, so... Would I... Would you? I would go Gastrodon to block potential Volt Switch. Like what can Megina yeah, do to get? You tank every hit anyway. Yeah. Like Flurkin after I mean, drop. What should be energy bomb Megina? <laughs> no, I've never seen that. I mean, he can double into Victini if he has energy ball, but that doesn't do much because he takes rocks and Pork can switch out and scout for that. Like I don't really see how Gypsy can win this. Like yeah, he's getting he, pressured a lot, and like the rocks, the rocks are doing the work as well. He can double into Zygat on the gas through, but like even then. Yeah, this, this is a hard matchup for. Uh, Gypsy. The guess it on hard walls pretty much everything. You will also, you also really annoying. I, I, I'm still, I'm still rooting for Gypsy King because yeah, I, just, like both I know players Gypsy. like I'm fine. With, I don't really care who wins. Yeah, I don't care either. But like, it's looking grim for Gypsy at this Alamola point. Alamola being poisoned. Even Viva looks really annoying. I mean, he does have the Magina, I guess. And I'm, I'm not assuming I mean, it's if, if the Magina gets beaten. <laughs> And Tornadoes yeah. looks also really annoying. Smash is hyped because both are like pretty much gods. Yeah, this I game, predict so. that I predict Poik to win this group. I Hard forgot guess, who else was in this. Yeah, probably Poik's game. Poik, yeah, he's like, just gonna recover. Up. I think Poik's game. Yeah, I agree with that Flurk can play as well because you now you force him to recover with the gas. I mean, while Flurk can was fine in the sense that he got another t turn of grass during recovery. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 
And he's gonna go and now you go hard pedal. I thought he Hello? was going He really wants a toxic this. I yeah, would just go. He really yeah, he's gonna wish. Again. He's gonna wish or knock off. Yeah, of course, but you will never get to let it get toxic. Yeah. Like that's a huge misplay. You have to. You have to. Switch it. is good. So you obviously will misplay this. You go hard, heat train here. Yeah, we we don't want to see the these misplays in this game because then this is gonna be a game where everyone can learn a lot. Yeah. Just watch you, people play. Would you guys play, go uh, Bulu here? Um, I think I think Bulu or Heatran. I think Bulu is. Uh, 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 he he's really the offensive wish. play. <laughs> um, I mean, if he's a wish in the uh, air, yeah, doesn't that think, just I, give I, them I a Jenna another Bulu. switch? If he goes Bulu here and he's a wishes in the air, this gives them a Jenna free switch. Yeah, Poe goes mm -hmm. into the Bulu. He does, yeah. Yeah, I think that's definitely right. Like he's going with Jenna one hundred percent. Because he can still keep land though. Like, so really a point can, land. if Poe is superpower, he sets up the SD here. Uh, yeah, um, I agree. Yeah, I'm not sure uh, about that because. Like, yeah, like, uh, no, you have to attack. Like, Otherwise, Lando gets back to full. <laughs> nah, he's not you going to, like, Lando here. Yeah. You don't know that. Yeah. <laughs> I assume it's Rocky Helmet or the PC left was on the Lando. Cause, um, no, Zim it was Rocky Helmet because Zimus, it was no lefties. Zemus don't take Helmet, I think, yeah. Zemus are broken. <laughs> yeah, they are. Yeah, <laughs> like like if he gets off damage on Majorna, I mean, huge damage on Majorna, then we will. Yeah, we went to Tornadus going, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, so he didn't let the land uh, cover, but... Mm. Yeah, I mean, I, mean, I agree with the play, you just pressure it's him. it's defensive land, or yeah, SD would have been fine. No, that's, that's still a fine play. But yeah, he it's can like, switch out here, predicting the... Like, like he, can, he, he can keep doing this and stall out wishes. Yeah, he can just go back into like, gas. He wins yeah. this. So I think I think Gypsy's gonna double on the gas turn, but into what is the question? Actually, yeah, he, actually, actually, actually. I know Zyga. Even if he SD'd over there, and uh, if he goes, if he goes on a Landris, doesn't he like uh, kill the Landris with the Horn Leech? So yeah, yeah, he does. Yeah, either way to just but, uh, sword stance. I don't like SD because if he went into. I mean, it still didn't kill him again, right? Plus yeah. two. Like if you have no, a gas to the walls, if you have the gas to the walls, the Majuna, why would you like? Ooh. Why would you sack your type of Bulu if you have a gas to the walls, the Majuna anyway? That's so. That's why. Uh, I like. Uh, I like this play. Now yeah. you can sub up again. I mean, gas run was fine. I don't. I don't know if he has sub because he showed rocks. That's true. I mean, I thought he has he sub at early, but oh, he's gonna try to burn. Yeah, he's a defensive one. He doesn't get it. Fair enough. So I think it's gonna be like taunt toxic, maybe. Uh, maybe. I mean, in that case, I, I probably would have talked it there. I could see Flash can maybe, because Tapu Lily looks a bit annoying to his team, but not really. He probably he, he probably didn't Toxic there because so an arrow, uh, yeah, he, he does have the wall switch or something like that. Yeah, he does have the arrows mm -hmm. as well as the waves. So now he just recover again. This just shows that like, like Zygarde is kind of weak, like Mew just eats this. This is bandit stab. Like, I think he is like on purpose, like bold with a lot of death. Because mm -hmm. like... His other ground resist is offensive type of Bulu, which is like not really a good ground resist. Like yeah, of course. It, it, it's just that uh, people are prepping for, for Zygarde a lot more now, so... S do you think this is Ice It looks like it's weak, but there was a time at which Ban Zygarde just came in and like six out of full team. I assume this is like Ruse, Devog, Wisp, and then it's either I Ice Beam, Volt Switch or Psychic. Like he could even whittle this right here. Like you, you don't risk this if you're Zygarde. Yeah, exactly. That's where yeah, you go. Uh, I mean, I don't really see what like Gypsy doesn't gain anything from doing this. I mean, he's starting out the soft no, no, no. to Mew, the roost to no, Mew. I, he I has get more what Gypsy was trying, uh, trying to do there. Gypsy was like, if he went for the Whisper over there, if uh, if Poik made a, if Poik went for the Whisper over there, and he went out in Alamola, then Poik would have to switch out the Mew, and he switches out the Mew mm -hmm. at uh, at, a, at a health of like seventy nine percent, and yeah. when he comes back in, he's at sixty seven percent. So he and gets he two Yeah, that's why he roosted, because he doesn't misplay. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. He, so basically, Gypsy King was hoping for a misplay there. Which, mm -hmm. which is like, which is pretty cool. Stupid. Because, uh, <laughs> no, no. It, it's no, not I can stupid, get the play because... I can, I can see why he did it, but like, if you're decently good, you don't do that. <laughs> yeah, but, but, but at this point, I think the matchup is like, f favored for Poix, so... I think Gypsy kind of needs to bank on a misplay. I mean, he can still break through the mule. 
because he has yeah exactly like, he can still break through the he mule, has more BP uh, and he can eventually crit it exactly exactly but it's um overall yeah, but, but, but he also has the bulu to like check the Zygons, overall so. it's in perks favor for sure yeah yeah mm -hmm. i almost left five minutes ago i wouldn't have been able to record this would be nice <laughs> yeah, I thought you only had 30 minutes. What happened? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to leave. Wish. I uh, know, I gotta record so this So now game. you're horny chicken because you don't want the Lando getting back up. This is gonna be a long game, isn't it? <laughs> like half of the moves to go for its recovery. <laughs> Including horn leech. Uh, you think he's always going Majorna or...? He should always go Majorna. Maybe he, and can, I maybe think, he can oh, go with oh, oh. Like he's stalling up a Momolo's wishes as well, slowly. <laughs> Who has 13 left. See you in one hour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is gonna be a long game. Oh, I think, yeah, the play is actually you know, always Horn Leech and not ST. Yeah, like either Magina or Victini, I think, is the switch in here. Like yeah, v I agree. Victini gets the wish back, so it doesn't And I would horn each of Pulu like, always. It's more offensive, which I think. I have a team like, I have a team. like Gypsies, where I have wish pass and no has a control. Isn't Pulu getting worn down though, by the way? Like by the spike and the toxic? Yeah, a little bit. Like maybe 10%. Uh, because the Magina does not cut him the enough. I exact same team like Gypsies, but just Mega Medicham over Victini. No. The thing is, <laughs> I used one of these teams on a live, and then I played versus Spikes and they just got overwhelmed. But I yeah, guess I guess he's relying see that. he's relying on his Greninja to get up Spikes, so the opponent has to defog. So it's either going to mm. be the opponent defogs for him, or both people have hazards up, and he has wish pass yeah. to support and like somewhat help against. Yeah, the, the Spike hazards. right now is helping him so much. Like I can. Why is but, there no timer on? By the way. <laughs> I don't know. They're just. They just don't care their friends. They say friends like, I'll give you all the time you want. <laughs> call, call it Dennis 2.0. <laughs> 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 if the time is your win gone, you go for that shit. Um, I'm not sure who wins this though, because Boodle is slowly getting worn down by the spike. I think Koi wins uh, it, but he has to be really patient. Yeah. He's not really getting worn down much if he goes for Horn Leech, because... Yeah, see, yeah, not much. Yeah, Bulu is such a good Yeah, Bulu gets so good after Mega, Mega Menagross ban. I would definitely mm. go to Gessrena right now. Jenna also one of the best ones at the moment. Yeah, Gessrena yeah. is fine. It's basically the two best ones in the field. He only shot Throw Current, so... Probably Volt Switch and... Flash can no ice beam and last move would be Maybe is he weak to Scissor? Does he need HP fire on this Magiona? Not really. He has Alamomola which can try to burn it. He has mm -hmm. Tini. I mean I can see still to see Scissor being a threat. But no one uses ST Scissor at the moment. No, <laughs> absolutely not. <laughs> Okay, yeah, he does nice go hard, Gasser. Makes sense. The Zygart using this crazy train. I mean, is it, is it, you don't risk the Zygart getting poisoned, right? You think it's worth it for. Yeah, but I don't think Poig is staying in because Gasser is kind of important to keep the Greninja from not getting Ash for him. Like, to avoid it. That yeah, I know, but you can recover up later on, like, Magina. Yeah, like, if you match to talk oh, to the Zygart, really... that's huge. Mm -hmm. I think they both switch out here, to no, be honest. I, I was thinking the Gypsy might try to toxic the Mew on the switch, in, but if you think he won't stay in, then I'm not sure anymore. I don't he's think not Gypsy toxic has toxic. Right? Yeah, he's 1000 waves and 1000 errors, so Outrage and E-Speed? He, he, he's 1000 waves over toxic. Yeah, and he I has agree. Toxic it's either Outrage and E-Speed then, or... Yeah, he, no, Outrage e and E-Speed are yeah, both have necessary, stem. but... If, if he's toxic, then he's toxic over the Outrage. Yeah, you were right, you should have a Dragon Step. Mm -hmm. Like late game drink step is nice to break through everything. Exactly. So that's why do you risk getting toxic here? I don't think you do. 
Which is why I think he should switch out. Yeah, into, but like, into what? Into Alamomola and be a just waste more time at wishing? Okay. Yes. Damn. <laughs> yeah, exactly It's not that. fun, the video's already 25 minutes. Really I cheap. know it's not fun, but like, <laughs> I, think it's, I think it's his best play. They both switch. He goes See, that's why. That's what I meant. Ooh. If he had Toxic, he could have gone for Toxic, and, but Alvarez just blows this away. So he's gonna go Tapu Bulu here. Yeah, of course. Yeah. And then I can see Poik doubling out, predicting the Majorna slash Victini. Go into Mew or? <laughs> yeah, probably double back that into Mew, so predicting the Majorna so he can roost it up. Yeah, he has to get Mew back Go up. into Bulu here. Double back into Mew, break the Majorna so you can roost, and Flurgan can't kill you, and he gets the drop so you can roost again. But I assume the Majorna will just Volt Switch if he goes into Mew again on a double. Watch him go to Heatran here. <laughs> well, wasn't Poix play to actually just recover with the Gastrodon? Uh, yeah. Like, how much does Outrage do to the Gastrodon? Oh, it would have done like. It's a fine play as well. I assume it would have done a lot, like 75. I assume it like 70? Yeah. Yeah, um, and but, but the Grassy Terrain think... is up, so. Yeah, With so you recovered? get back like 60. Yeah. Yeah. Got, back over, would... uh, got back up to full, so I think his play was still recovery yeah. there actually. Do you think he would ever risk his Mew here and stay in? Cause Outrage would do 85 to 101. Oh, Gypsy's locked in, never mind, he's locked in. I was of about course. to say would oh Gypsy double here, no, but no, 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 then no, I realized no. he's was it, was it a count for Max Spidef? Because he's not Max yes. Spidef. Gastrodon runs like a mix. He, he has defense in this They run mixed defense. Because yeah. How much? Dark Pulse would never do 31 to a Gastrodon. I looked That's true, I guess. I'll look it up for you. I have to spread that Poké GG Gamma runs, it's mixed defensive. But I hate Dark opening the team below the legs. Man, I put Gypsy in, in my surge instead of Gastrodon because I'm confused. <laughs> 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 Wait, what I think it? that's not true. With Max for death, uh, it still could do 37. <laughs> yeah, i show you the spread that I have. Yeah, sure. I'm 144 in defense. Can you cut that? 144, alright. Still call nature, I'm assuming. Call nature, yeah. I'll go drink some water and be right back. Okay, okay. Uh, then outrage is 71 to 84. Yeah, I That's don't know who is lot. taking the time here. Yeah. Uh, I think, think Poeg is taking the time because Gypsy's locked in so he doesn't really have much to think about. Yeah, Gypsy cannot think about anything. I'm pretty sure they <laughs> agreed on the timer off because they're friends. Make Megan ask <laughs> I mean, if you know about each other that you're gonna play the entire game and only would make moves if you're DCing, then it's fair. <laughs> but otherwise, yeah, timer. So this Starcraft is still very, very, very threatening. Is he thinking about if he wants to go Heatran or Bulo, or why is he taking so long? Yeah, I think that's the play. Right, how much um, does Heatran take? Maybe he wants to see if we've all lifted and what's oh, the Does it take like 30, I assume? 30. 35, maybe? Oh, yeah, 33. 33. I mean, with Grassy Terrain, I mean, it's, fine. Was, it's fine, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, what's happening? He went, he went he switched to the on Outrage to 33. And he goes for it again. Oh, he's yeah, still he locked in. He got a 3 turn, he got a 3 turn, he was locked. So he's gonna go for the... Oh, the that Toxic, toxic okay, is pretty good. nice. For Poi. Yeah. But Heatran is low as fuck and he does not have Wish. The Spike is gonna wear him down. Yeah. Very, very hard. Heatran is almost dead, but he already got up the rocks and poisoned this, so they could already... Yeah, the Toxic and Zygarde is huge. Oh shit, the Zygarde got toxic, that's huge. Mag Magn put in the timer, he had enough. Yep. <laughs> yeah, Did it was high time. The time? Like, like, oh shit. Like, like, is it fine if the timer is not on, if both players agree to it? I'm not sure. I think sure it's fine, yeah. it doesn't didn't respond. Really respond. Yeah. It didn't respond, he asked that you guys agree in no time mm -hmm. or something. Nobody give a shit. <laughs> 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 they probably ignored Spectre, so I'm not sure if they can. You cannot ignore. Uh, you cannot uh, ignore right? Magn because he's like. Yeah. A driver okay, or a mod okay. or whatever it's called. Yeah. Moderate, it's been 28 global, global minutes moderator. for 26 turns. <laughs> yeah, in 29 minutes recording, 27 turns. This feels like. Whoa, did you see <laughs> the damage in rolls, by the way? The 33 and then 39? Yeah. What the fuck? Uh, do you stay yeah, in here if you're public? I would consider doubling no. into, let me think. Probably Bulldo. I would consider doubling into Mew and the Alamomola, but then again, Alamomola probably has Toxic, so... Uh, or, or, did already show Toxic? So that's risky. On the what? On Alamomola? Yes. You don't want to let the Mew get poisoned, so... Um, then I'm not sure if I would double into Mew then. Yeah, 
isn't a chance to hit yourself in confusion. Uh, it's 33. 33, I think. Used to be 50, it's now 33, yeah. Yeah. So he might just go on a Bulu to get the terrain back, because the terrain also the, helps. The chain is actually... The terrain I helps his really terrain, the and the terrain helps his Mew to eventually do you, bring do you them guys back. Like, do you guys like like the change 50% into 33? Because like, now I rarely see, uh, play, uh, like, uh, uh, suppose Garchomp blocks. It's gonna be really annoying when Marshadow comes out, mm -hmm. because you can boost your opponent's attack, and then... Like, you can go for Swagger on your opponent, and then it's only a... And then he can take it. That's true. Like, I don't <laughs> I really like that strategy. That. That's so cancerous. Did he attack? Please attack. Please tell me he attacked. I would have attacked. Oh, he wow, didn't. we didn't sack off the land. Oh, but he goes hard. You... That's still fine, right? You might outspeed, should outspeed it and if it has Ice Beam or Psychic. You should outspeed. And even, even if he doesn't outspeed because he's defensive lander, he just... He should nah, be able to take it. Mew has more base speed, so he should, if he just runs a little wait, bit wait, of wait, speed, wait. he should be faster. Does he, does, he, does, he, does he go for soft board or does he go for... Um, I think he would just... Does he like knock out the landers because he has no one rocks up? But I think yeah, he's definitely yeah. his place definitely soft world. Yeah, probably soft world, but yeah, I, could I agree. See Gypsy going into Majorna. Like, or you, you can yeah, you can always defog the rocks oh, away if you want rocks. to with the Mew. So now he pressures um, now he pressures him to defog, which means the rocks will yeah. go off Gypsy's side, which is cool for his. I think he's gonna defog right now. Cause um, he has yeah, to I, think, much. I, I think I think I think Gypsy is gonna stay in and click keep clicking rocks. Hmm. Um, yeah, maybe you're right. That's the potential play if the mute, most mutes don't carry taunt, like it can't really afford taunt. Because yeah, yeah, exactly. Defog roost and then Will Wisp and one attacking move most of the time. And mm -hmm. Heatran is already yeah. low as fuck, so it's gonna be hard for Poik to get rocks up again. If he defogs here. But he kinda has to defog because this is annoying, like two layers on his side. Like one rock and one spike. Yeah, it's too much. Poik should not defog because, yeah, Gypsy clicks rocks. Gypsy's yeah, gonna end up with rocks, I see, yeah. I mean, that's fine for yeah. Poet. BTB. Like, is he gonna keep clicking it? Or? Yeah, he's gonna keep clicking it. BTB with the analysis because, at some point. Yeah, this, this, this yeah. is what I think. I think what Poet should have actually done is knocked out the landers yeah, and okay, then gone for the default. I mean, he had to yeah, roost, right? He had to roost. <laughs> No, 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 after No, no, when he no, roosted, he went roost. for rocks, and then he had a spike and a rock on his side. So BTB is saying yeah. he should have killed exactly. him first. So he just knocks, so he just had to knock out the landers because uh, a poet can still keep his rocks, so it's not that mm -hmm. bad in the end. Yeah. Uh, uh, but now poet has like uh, rocks on his side of the field, but a Gypsy doesn't have no rocks on his field. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, but, but overall it's still fine. I can see him I mean, doubling I guess I don't like the fact that it's not Spike, but a rock. I can see him doubling out into like... Yeah, yeah, that, you're right, you're right, so yeah. But the, the Zygot being toxic is actually huge, because otherwise he could double into Zygot mm -hmm. here and put on some yeah. pressure. But and now he's gonna he keep still, taking damage. He can still double into Zygot here, yeah, because Gastron is gonna come out, I assume. Where, on, on, which, on which Pokemon is gonna get Heatran back in? Like, maybe Omegirna? I'm not really sure, but what was I trying to say? Do you think he would stay in here potentially because he can live anyone hit? It's no, like, I would do turn. Yeah, he needs uh, the foot. He needs I mean, the foot. Right? Yeah. Yeah. No, the, 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 the Greninja doesn't have U-turn. He has spikes, dark pulse, water shooting, hydro pump. Oh, true. Dark pulse. Yeah. I mean, this Greninja just yeah, slowly dying. Dark pulse was a fine play in case Poi was staying in, mm -hmm. and now this forces the Gaster to yeah, recover. Uh, look, look at the dark pulse damage. It is 36. It's definitely defensive. Uh, it has it still makes death. defensive. Dude, yeah, it has some if it's max for death, it does 31 to 39. You know no. that, right? Wow. Really? <laughs> if it's cold, max for death. Did you cut regular Greninja? Try specs? Or yes. Ash Ninja? Okay, wow. No, regular. That shit is strong. Yeah. I mean, it's Joy Specs. So that. he's not gonna stay in here. He's gonna go Bulu or. Or Heatran. <laughs> Let me see. I mean, getting up his rocks is pretty nice. I mean, what would, yeah. what would the Mon be that Gypsy could, out dub could double into? Um, Saigar? So if he predicts Heatran slash Bulu, does he have one double switch that covers Heatran and Bulu? No. So that's tough. Maybe it depends on the stats, I guess. He Maybe just go for Wish. He team, yeah, he does. So if he has Toxic, it would be really nice to get the Toxic off on the Mew. Yeah, yes. Yeah, so. already showed it. Okay, I'm bad. <laughs> yeah. I didn't yep. know. <laughs> so now he has to switch out again. Um, so the Mew basically took like 6%. Leftovers healed uh, half the damage. Leftovers cancelled out half the damage that Rocks did. 
Mm, you think he's gonna Wait, hit you? Why did he go hard mute on a potential toxic? I think he predicted some double, I don't know. It was weird. Oh, he predicted the skull? He predicted the skull, maybe he was hoping that he would get burned. So that he can't get Yeah, maybe. But even then. Just eat what? Yeah, this is kind of bad for Poik. I completely That's agree with really bad for Poik. I completely agree with Toxic in there, though, because in case he yeah, stays course, in to course. get rid of the rocks, you obviously want to get this poison. Does he have heal bell? <laughs> now he can um, wish again. Now I'm pretty sure his last move is Will Wisp. Come on, last move, last move heal bell. No, Show way. it. Show it. <laughs> that would be so sick. Nope. Hard the thing is, this at is, least you get up your this rocks. This is good again. for Poig in the sense that the rocks are gone for the entire game. Yeah, now. rocks are never gonna go up again, and you but can get your. But Zygat is still really Greninja. annoying. Yeah, I think Kaninja would come in, but like he still has the Gastron, so this is fine. Yeah, uh, is he gonna go Spike again? I think he's gonna Spike again. Yeah, Spike is a nice play. I would Spike yeah, again. Yeah, I think he's definitely flicking spikes here. Okay, no, 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 no. This is this is actually an interesting. At first, for him because... I thought he might double into Zygarde because I kind of get a kill, mm. but Spikes is fine. Like, uh, does Poik actually risk? If he doesn't this? have hazards, then Poik is not uh, pressured. Yeah, 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 it's good. But like, Mew doesn't want to switch in with the poison, and no one, nothing really wants to switch in with Bennett Zygarde anyway. But I can understand that he wants to get up to Spike first, and then Southern Arrows, he can click it still. What? He turns later. Heart Bulu. <laughs> Yeah, so you predicted either the Zygarde or the dark or the Spike there, which is a really nice play on yeah. Poik's part. Swords danced. Oh shit, he's going in. Pretty sure that Majuna can live any hit. Assume it's gonna yeah, be max easily. HP for sure. And easily. Oh, he just lets flash it go down. Cannon or Flurry Cannon if he doesn't have flash. Yeah, he but just he lets it go flash down. Can, yep. Interesting. And I think Bulu did so much, dude. We can either go Gast or no. If he has Heat Wave, he can go Torn. He's just gonna click Lava Bloom. Lava Bloom doesn't even kill this guy, right? Because it's AV. Uh, does it? I want to count. Wait, if it if it is max spit if no, it probably I assume doesn't. it's just. I mean, he tried is pretty much back to full, but doesn't outrage pretty much get a kill? Okay, switch it out. Like, is this a 50 50? <laughs> no, no, Or do you just always thousand arrows? Just yeah, thousand arrows arrows like yeah, you're right, because Voodoo is gone. You can't do really switch him with spike and poison, yep. Yeah, you're right, you just click thousand arrows. So Gypsy looking like he can bring this back. I really thought Poi yeah, won this earlier. He nice. made some wild plays. Lily Mew getting toxic was his biggest mistake. Um, do you go hard? He does go. It is wow, getting too killed. Oh, wow, he really went for interesting. Outrage. That's crazy. Oh. Like that was one of the reasons why I was like, yo, stay in with Heat. Maybe Southern Arrows wouldn't have to hit KO the Mew. So that could be the reason. Yeah. Because the poison. I mean, it would have. With toxic? No, no. Would've. The first turn, the poison only does a little bit. It gets stronger with over the time. Yeah, I, I know that. But still. <laughs> yeah, Mew's yeah, but gone. This I is think, looking grim I think for he could have lived 2,000 arrows. But he, he's locked in, so he can go Weewa and kill this now. Or Tornadus. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. So that's, hard that's really annoying oh, for Gypsy that he got a 3 turn. Yeah, that's nice. Then. Why does he go Tornadus over Maybe his HP eyes? He's probably yeah. HP eyes. Whoa! <laughs> this life of like not see coming. Life of HPIs. I mean, it's really nice because um, after Stealth Rocks, Zapdos dies to Hurricane plus HPIs. I think it has a chance to die, so that's why Tornadoes can run HPIs. Nice. I mean, yeah. Poik obviously... is definitely in a superior position at the moment. It's obviously for Zygarde and Lando too. I still think Thousand Arrows was a better play because he would not have been locked in with Outrage. Yeah. I, I, yeah. P2 I, I think said he. P2 said what did he lose from T arrows? I thought that would tweet kill Mew from there. Yeah, I think so I'm too. Not dude. Sure. With the toxic, even though Grass Drain was up, I still still think it would KO'd. He was at 90, 94. After Spike was at eighty two. I definitely think it did about forty two percent, uh, forty one. I guess even. The players know Calx better. Uh, I guess they made the right move because probably it was a roll for thousand arrows to knock it out, or oh, maybe Gypsy misplayed. I I, I honestly think he did. Like, think it was a roll. This. I've never seen Gypsy make a misplay ever, so... Yeah, he might upload Let's see how much did... How much did Thousand Arrows do before? He might upload... It 39. They might both upload it the did. game on that channel and then... Oh, it was a roll. That's the problem. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that it was. Mm -hmm. It yeah. was a roll to and two what's, that, what's that, the, That's why Gypsy... What's, what's the chance, outrage? by the way, to get Outwitch? I don't know, he got a roll of 39, 41, 44... No, what's 44, the chance that like... Outwitch locks you in for a third turn? It's 50. 
Okay, so it's, it's either two or three turns. It's a fifty percent chance, as far as I know. It's a fifty-fifty in the <laughs> yeah. In every sense. Man, that's like something that's a bit annoying about Pokemon. Like, I mean, I, I'm not, I'm fine with rolls, but like okay, stuff so like getting Gypsy locked got a two in. Turn in like wouldn't he be? In, wouldn't he be in a superior position? What if he didn't uh, get locked? Because in? he still has a he still has a Zygarde. So whenever the Zygarde comes in on the um the Heatron, he just clicks thousand arrows and gets a kill. So. Yeah, if but he, I'm not so sure. Maybe that, thousand arrows was the better play because he could have just switched out on the mm -hmm. Ice Beam and to. He could have switched. Yeah, into then you would force another 50-50, But yeah, like, yeah. he could have switched I, I think, yeah, out into I think, like I Alma Mola on the Mew and get a free wish. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm yeah, I so agree. The, yeah, the longer yeah. I think I, about, I think, yeah. the longer I think about it, I might yeah. have gone for thousand arrows. Yeah. Mhm. Mm I think. I think that was. A, I think that was probably a misplay. Yeah, I agree. So Alma Mola's in. Is he gonna wish again? Like try to pass it into his freaking Greninja again? Because Greninja's getting lower. Unless this has taunt. Oh, it's gonna protect. On the hurricane. Yo, if this is like. Oh, shit. That's gonna hurt. It's obviously gonna be mixed defense, but this is still gonna be like 55. Yeah. So he might have. Um, if he has knockoff. No, he showed always. What did he show? He showed which protect toxic. Wh so he's a scald or knockoff. I think. Um, assuming knockoff? I don't know if Tapu Fini is common. Why would you run toxic and scald? I don't know if Tapu Fini is common enough to run. I mean, scald is only for stuff like Toxapex because you can't. <sighs> you can't toxic Toxapex. So scald is it nice sucks. to burn Toxapex. Oh, that hurricane miss really sucked. Yeah. That, oh oh my, my god, stop. Oh wow. And so now he has to like heat wave because he wants to keep the again low. Looking really bad. The the game is paying Poik back, but it's obviously a higher chance to get a three turn outrage. The the, yeah. the chance is higher than like missing hurricane like a, a few mm -hmm. two times in a row. So the hex is lagging. It's a nine percent chance to miss it twice in a row. But, but the thing is Gypsy kinda has to go for the hacks at this point. So that's like understandable, I guess. Yeah, I don't know what else's play was. I guess he could have gone Scarf Victini, but that's still mind games between. Like, like Gypsy making Gipsy the best plays, and yeah, yeah. I, like Gypsy is making the right, best plays he can make, and uh, he's getting rewarded as well. So. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. Like, like. Um, <laughs> you have to go for something that kills McGinnis right now, but I'm not really sure what moves he has. I'm assuming it's like a heat wave. Uh, maybe superpower. Uh, would it be superpower? I, I think it would be. HPS hurricane. Um, also, I think uh, Poek, uh, po uh, Poek sucking wow. the Mew was, was, was fine. So, he did uh, go into Victini. Because Mew got... is not doing anything in this Cause... game other than like uh, walling the Landris and walling the Zygarde, so. Yeah. yeah, I guess. I, I um, guess that was the start process when he sacked the mm, Mew. He didn't want the Magina to get the wish, which is why obviously Heat Wave. Isn't this Victini gonna nuke him? Can't he? The thing is, it's between Bolt Strike and U Turn and V Crit. I mean, we don't know it's set. It could be Energy Ball. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure his Scarf was um, Bolt Strike. With U Turn, Bolt Strike, V Crit. Yeah, I think, I think the I last think move he's is gonna click like, U Turn here. The last move is like, I don't know, it could be. They don't really want to have that, yeah, right? I think it's... This is Scarf Victini, and if it is Scarf Victini, Gypsy's best place to just click U-turn here. I mean, it has to be Scarf. On the is incoming heat run. Scarf. And I don't think Poik is going to stay in here because uh, the Torrenty is, like, uh, really useful for him. Yeah. So it breaks V-Create slash U-turn there and gets it correct. Ooh. Poik the god. Ooh. Thank god. <laughs> uh, it's probably Scarf then. I mean, we assumed that, but, like, it, it yeah, basically yeah, okay. confirms it. Uh, Okay, okay, let me think this through. Oh, why, did he, he, why did he recreate there? You think recreate was the right play there? Because he's definitely not risking the taunty, and if he just U turns there, uh, like, yeah, if he just U turns him, then what, he what does U turn give you? Go back into LO? I mean, recreate was only. Uh, oh, he's not sure he's got. Well, oh my. What is okay, he? Okay, is okay. he Z move? Now we know. Oh, maybe he's Z move. Could be Z move. So he's relying. Uh, this is really so bad. So he doesn't have a choice, Scarf. Okay, he's okay. relying on a bulky now that core. That may make a lot of sense. His team has a bulky core and double priority, so he doesn't necessarily need the scarf. I get it, but I still would have thought about scarf. But what is it? It has to be yeah. Z move. It has to be Z move. Whew. Holy shit! Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Let me think. Yeah. So he might actually he might actually be mixed to lower the gas run, but 
You think it would be Just icy wind timers. or? Hmm. So he's gonna set the heat turn don't... here. Whoa! What the what? fuck? The fuck? But he outsped. Why did the he? Heat. Why did he lava plume? Why didn't the Earth Power? Uh, he doesn't what? have. He didn't show what? Earth Power yet. He showed Star Fox lava plume toxic. I don't know who's left. Yeah, what's his lava plume? Maybe Taunt. So, so. Maybe. No, no, like. No. I, I don't know. <laughs> no. no. Yeah. Why is he Trick Room? No, what? What did you say? No, he. Like, why did he t a trick room on that turn? I'm I'm not sure. I don't get, understand. Like, if Victini knocks, if Vic if he just went went for the bolt strike there and knocked out the heat run. Yeah. Uh, trick room is then weird the boy because. Boy could, could not have gone out into his uh, Gastron because yeah. he still fears a uh, energy ball. But now Gastron is like hundred percent faster Victini than the Victini, and, and he just goes yeah. into the Gastron. Yeah, I was gonna say, doesn't he go into Gastron now, and like get a kill with earthquake? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, exactly. Twenty that, seconds. Oh, Just plumes again. It's still yeah, flash fire. I don't fire, really I guess. know what the trick room did there on the specific turn. Do you taunt here? No, you, you don't even outspeed it, so it doesn't even matter. Uh, okay, so he's gonna get off a wish on the Victini, I guess. That's that was the game plan. Yeah. Probably. Wishes on the lava plume. The trick room is gonna be but also lava plume. Heatran is recovering a lot. How much of both strike to do Heatran? Let me score up a bit. Trent and Alola has four. taken a lot of damage because of the Toxic and Stealth. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I don't understand those plays. Um, or, please have Earth Power. God damn it. Yeah, I don't think he has it. He would have clicked the button. I know. It's just it's surprise kill, man. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so Bolt Strike did 34 before. Uh, Trick Room is still up right now. Hey, BR said I really don't get this. Is he talking about the game or is he talking uh, about the, yeah, the, game. the timer being so low? Because earlier he said you're giving unfair advantages, reminding one player of timer. That's true. I mean, you shouldn't do that. That's not unfair. Like, what? That's fine. Yeah, I was gonna say, this he train is dead? Uh, he loses it's... nothing by bolt striking, Gypsy King. Yeah. Yeah, he, he gave the Elamola too much freedom to wish everything. I mean, I get that v Trick Room works with V-Create if you get the speed drop, so it's like you get faster in Trick Room. Mm -hmm. But as long as the heat is there, you don't really get like you don't really get to spend yeah, V-Create at the, the moment. Like, didn't enough of the good position after I'm... the after the Trick Room play because his Quite Victini exactly. is like much lower than it had to be. But his mm -hmm. and he even get, his Alamola is a bit more weakened. Doesn't he get a free knockoff with Lula? And, and, and this is the exact same situation. Yeah, he that's, could true, have had that's a, true. He could have had an healthier Alamola and he could have had a healthier Victini. Yeah, but he clicks knockoff so, anyway. You're definitely going to weave on click knockoff, I agree. Yep. Um, that's the only play. Or, getting rid or, of Alamola. Or if he's... Or, Alamola yeah, is also yeah, really low, dude. After Rock, is it like 50? Alamola is at like... Maybe 58. 52, I think. He's at 32. Plus 33 after rocks, so 65 min 12, which is 53, and then he has toxic as well. Uh, but he has leftovers, so yeah, so, yeah Alamola, if, it, if it's bandits, then Alamula might get to it killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, I'm I don't think Alo can switch in, yeah, because he can definitely Alamola not switch in anything. He yeah, he's gonna sack the Victini on the journal. Yeah, I think he would sack the Victini here. Yep, and it's Z move, so he go. didn't have an item, it was Z move Victini. Too bad. I wanted to Does see. Does die at 22? Was he Z V yeah, create? I think it does. Someone I think said, it does as well. Poik said it was Mega Stone. <laughs> <laughs> it dies. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. 27 min. Yeah. Uh, you yeah, think po it was like Z V now, I think. I really like, fired, right? What's his play here? Is he gonna go to Greninja? Is he gonna go to Alamomola? What's I mean, his play? If I Greninja is a free he... Gastrodon, so I'm not sure. But if he goes to Alamomola, he clicks knockoff. Yeah. So is, he, is he gone double Alamola. into Alo okay, and get a wish? Greninja. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Go double. But then what? Then he just EQ, right? Uh, it's, it's yes, tough, I think he just... has to go for five hit water shuriken. And I don't think even five hits knocks it out. No, he's a Gastrodon. Like, Viva is me, but I don't think five no, hits knocks it out. No, he's just gonna go to Gastrodon. Turn oh, off. Yeah. That's See, fine, that's what I did. I mean, Greninja outspeeds me, so why would he water shuriken anyway? 
No, we were outspeed Skurinja, I'm bad. No, Never mind. Ninja does not yeah, I was, me, I was going though. of Kurinja being Ash form already, I'm bad. <laughs> you can ban me from my own channel, it's fine. Um, yeah, 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 he's <laughs> placed to knock off here. I, I, I would just knock off here, to be honest. Yeah, but Gasserun is like the safest play overall. Like, what does he lose? He actually yeah, said, what's his set? He doesn't lose anything, but... I don't know, I just feel like being aggressive at this point. I mean, point, you will so. tell him after the match anyway, what the fuck? We've all, we've all threatening now, dude. Holy shit. Please do not turn yeah, it back on. Until our stuff says it's okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, listen, listen. Um, okay, no, nothing. Nothing interesting <laughs> to you. But I said listen, then... <laughs> I, like, I don't know why you wouldn't go gas room, I didn't see. Like, yeah, you can stay in, but what if he crits you with Hyrule Pump or something? Exactly, exactly. Why would you risk it? What's he gonna do? Double to Magir now? Mm, doesn't really help you. Double to Alamola? Doesn't really help you. Guess who's at full, so... Easy to switch in. Okay. If he knocks yeah, off... Yeah. yeah, yeah. ...on the Hydro... Oof. Does uh, Water Shuriken can kill? If he gets enough hits... Uh, yeah. Probably... It definitely uh, does. Why did he risk his Weevil, though? I mean, the thing I about mean, Greninja is it I dies now. Gasserun wins, <laughs> Gasserun wins anyway. Yeah, I agree. What the fuck? Because it, the animal is toxic. But he could have played... Just dies. Like, he didn't have to make that play, but he should still win anyway. Yeah, I agree. It's gonna be close, but I do think that Gasserun just wins. Like, he also has Tornadoes, which is, like, key in the mm -hmm. sense that if his Gasserun gets toxic, that he can still switch out. Exactly. So the toxic doesn't wreck up too get the much. region back. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And also, if you okay. hit any of these hurricanes earlier, it would have been probably like super low or dead. Any. Oh time. yeah, then it's it, it's fucking Ella would be dead probably. Because <laughs> he did get off like two lava plumes yeah, as now well. Yeah, now he's placed a definitely going on a gastrodon here. Yeah. And uh, Gypsy's only play just Gypsy's place so I'll always go on the Alamola here, I guess, because he uh, yeah I guess. Alamola is the play here, I'm not sure. Like, I see why he did that, but what does he gain? Because Poic is never gonna let him wish up either of these mons ever again. Earth power, oh, he's special. Yeah. Let's actually help him. <laughs> because you earth power again. Yeah, like, like no, no, fish. Gypsy's only play was to Alamola there. Well, I mean, the Toxic uh, is gonna wreck up. Some kind of a choke, okay, yeah, exactly. so that he can exactly. get off a wish. It's not gonna get it off, ever, because it's Toxic. Yeah, it, it, it never gets it off, yeah. yeah this is all over. It's literally over. You just keep spamming Earth Power right Poic now. Always has, yeah, Poic should just keep keep clicking uh, Earthquake here at all Earth costs. Yeah. Guess yeah, is Earth a cool mon if you can if you can avoid getting flinched. Guess one is really nice, definitely. <laughs> I mean, okay. it doesn't really matter because I, the Greninja is at uh, no no at not, like four not at the <laughs> moment. I mean, in general, because I remember Blunder used the Guess one SPL and he got flinched by Scarf Hoopa, I think. Yeah, 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 definitely. Like if the, the I don't think the Grand risked it ever. Uh, the dark yeah, he didn't go range. for it because he was poisoned, so it yeah, was, oh, he missed. Exactly. I mean, the miss sucks, Ooh, but that's actually big. it shouldn't be game changing. But it shouldn't matter at all. I mean, he also he missed, gets a kill he now. He also missed two hurricanes earlier. Yeah. yeah. Like, like considering he missed two hurricanes, uh, I guess the miss is still. Mm -hmm. Like, this didn't matter because he can still switch. Yeah, it, yeah, it, and it doesn't matter also. Like, his, also his Greninja is at, like. The Greninja dies to Toxic yeah, after Rocks, yeah, so totally yeah, it's, not not like, it's not like he can come back with Greninja. Yeah. And yeah, I don't I know. If, only for some reason I thought for yeah, a second that Greninja... This was a, this was a good game. This was, a, this was a fun game to watch. Yeah, I agree. F 50 it was a very good minutes. game. Uh, and I, I, I think Gypsy misplayed, like kind of misplayed in a, a few turns. I would never or, say he misplayed. I don't uh, have... It's maybe something which we don't understand because it was a weird... A thousand thing. arrows. We said it, we, we, yeah, we, we basically don't know what Gypsy was going for, so... We just assume it's a misplay, so uh, mm -hmm. like I'm not like we're not sure what what he was thinking right there. So yeah, yeah. agreed, agreed. But it, but it was still a great game and uh, fun to watch. Two high quality players going at it. Yeah, it's yeah, very cool. I actually predicted um, <laughs> Gypsy to finish second in this group after Poke, but we will see what happens. Who's in the group? Okay, he's still about? Earth Power. Yeah. But yeah, um, goes to Grant and he dies. Po po okay, Spain GG. was 0-2 at the moment because Solvent got robbed because he lost the time and didn't send his team in. So you can say it's his own fault, but he still got robbed. And who else lost? Someone lost for the Oros OU game between Spain and Greece. The, the, I think Spain lost there too. So Spain finally picked up a win with uh, Poik mm -hmm. winning over yeah. Gypsy King. That, 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 that game was cool definitely cool fun. Gypsy in Oceania. Yeah. Thank yeah. you guys for watching. And I definitely gotta leave now. Peace out. <laughs>